Hey, welcome back to another video. Uh, last video, I said that we'd open the the Shining Fates Pikachu V box and the other tin, the other Pokeball tin that I got. So we'll be doing that today. So we'll be opening one of these, a nice little Ultra Ball tin, and of course this right here. It's a little out of frame, but you, you know what it looks like. I'm not quite sure how I'm gonna display the oversized promo, but I'm sure I'll find a way. Uh, and again, I've got my assistant with me today. Can't really see in the in the reflection. Oh, no, there you go. Uh, so we're going to go ahead and open, I guess, the tin first again. So we got some pretty decent pulls from the boxes last video, or the box last video. Again, with the, the hardest shit plastic that I cannot peel. There we go. And from the Pokeball tins, we unfortunately got nothing great last time. So I'm gonna hope our luck has changed for today. All right, let's open this up and see what kind of packs we got in here. And looks like the same as the other one. Yep, we've got one Sun and Moon base set, a Guardians Rising, and another X and Y Fates Collide. Do you actually wanna look up how much they cost? Oh, wait a minute, there's a... <laughs> Is the coin stuck on the edge? It is a uh, oh shit uh, a Volcanian pin. So that's pretty cool. Add that to the collection as well. So this is going to be the official uh, pins and coin collection tin. So there you go. And of course we now have another one, which I cannot seem to close. There we go. All right, so the same as last video, we are going to be opening the base set first. Uh, I learned my lesson from last time about the code card, which I now have forgotten. Uh, I think I want to open it like... Uh, do I, I want to flip it? I want to flip it. Yes, we want to flip it. We want to flip it. Want to flip it, get rid of the code card. Go four to the front. And what do we have? We have starting off with a fire energy. We've got a charger bug. A poison barb. Team skull grunt. Uh, a pretty demented looking Eevee. <laughs> it's got a sandy ghast. A crochet polywag. A skarmory. Morlol. A reverse steeny. And. Oh! Oh, a Taurus GX. Wow. That is a pretty good pull to start off. Uh, and you can see the little, like, rocks on the edges of the card as well. It's got, you know, nice detail there. Wow. Okay, first pack of the day is a GX. Uh, def definitely not mad at that at all. Let's go ahead and sleeve that one. Damn. Um, yeah, wow. Great pull for, for the first pack for sure. And of course we'll be chucking that in the top loader as well, just because it's a GX. And they're pretty cool to keep, I think. <coughs> so, uh, yeah, very nice pull for the first pack. Let's move on to the next one, eh? Let's put you right there. Ah, that's nice. That's beautiful. That's beautiful. Alright, next up we're gonna do the Guardian Rising pack, uh, featuring Tapu Koko at the front. Is it a foreshadow? Who no. knows? We'll see. Again, I can't open this fucking pack. Stupid ass piece of garbage. There we go. Alright, so again, I want to flip it, right? I want to flip it. I want to flip it, yes. Got a Helioptile at the front there. Get rid of the code card. And we have four to the front. Let's get it. Uh, starting off with a water energy. Cool. Got a Matang, a Sudowoodo, a Rescue Stretcher, a Helioptile, a Machop looking absolutely massive, Slowpoke, an Alolan Vulpix, very cute, a Beldum, a Reverse Rockruff, and oh. a regular Oricorio. Oh well, that's a bit disappointing, but that's alright. Next pack. X, Y, Fates Collide. These uh, these have gone up in value, obviously, because they 
were released when? In 2016 or before. Uh, but we're gonna open it up anyway. Because that's what we do here on this channel. We have a snubble. Fuck! I ruined it. God damn it. Go forward to the front. Uh, I think that means that we won't get anything great, but we'll see anyway. Got a Rotom. I quite like that design, actually. That's pretty cool. Got an Alakazam Spirit Link. Got a Fossil Excavation Kit, like the one you get from uh, Diamond and Pearl, which is pretty cool. We got a Warmadam, a Snubble hiding under the table, some Bronzor, a Mincino, too cute dealing, Carbink, a, a Reverse Alteria Spirit Link, and oh, that was the rare. Wait, what? Did I fuck up there? Okay, I don't know what happened there, but. I guess the reverse was on the end. How many cards is that? Seven, eight, nine, ten. Uh, okay, so I did something wrong there, but hey, that's still pretty cool. All right, uh, one hit out of three packs. That's not terrible, I would say. Now, on to the big boy. And again, we're going for the Shining VMAX Charizard, if anything. But I will definitely settle for anything else as well. So let's get this open. Let's slide that out nice and easy. All right, and so we have. Huh? Wait, what? Oh, okay, there's another piece of plastic on the back here. There we go. And of course, we have the Pikachu promo, looking very nice, very shiny. And of course, the oversized one as well. Look at the size difference of that. That's insane. Like double, double the height, just, just over. That's still pretty cool. Uh, I need to find somewhere to display this, or even a sleeve to put this in, but we won't worry about that right now. And of course we have four Shining Fates booster packs. We have a Shining VMAX Charizard pack, we got two Shining Corviknights, and a Toxtricity one. Let's open up one of the doubles, the Shining Corviknight. Uh, I believe with the Shining Fates the code card is exposed. So I don't think I need to worry about opening it the wrong way. Let's hope not. Nope, I do. God damn it, okay. So, open it from the back. Take the code out that way. And let's hope for something good. Forward to the front. Starting off with a fire energy. Another rusted sword. Ball guy. The wacky, I don't think we have him yet. A more, ki more pico. Coughing, Gossiflor, Rowlet, a Qfant. Hey, we have a shiny Zigzagoon. Nice white and red color. And for the last one, uh, just a regular Celebi. But hey, we got a shiny card. Nice. Add that to the collection for sure. Yeah, so that's that's a great pull to start off to start off the Pikachu box. As you can see, that's 78 out of 122 from the shiny vault. Yeah, that's awesome. I, I really like the the red on the Zigzagoon. All right, three more packs to go. All right, which one do we want to start off with? Charizard. All right, we're going up. We're going with the Charizard. Straight to the Charizard. Let's go. Let's open that one. Uh. That way, yes. Need to work on opening these stupid packs. Got the code card there. One, two, three, four to the front. Starting off with a Steel Energy, an Aldegoss, another Dartrix, Luxio, Horsey. Snom just sitting in the park. More Peko. Cacnea. A Choodle. A reverse Rotom. And oh, okay, another just a regular Yen Yen Mega. Alright, two more packs to go. I'm gonna go with this one. I'm gonna go with the Toxtricity one. Let's hope we get another card from the Shining Vault. Oh fuck, I saw the code card. That's alright. Um, okay, so I'm gonna take it out that way. Go one, two, three, one, two, three, four to the front. Starting off with a Psychic Energy. Cool. 
a Cramorant. We have a Rusted Shield. I don't think we have that. Dartrix, Gossiflor, Cacnea. I'm seeing all the same cards, which is quite sad, but I guess there are only 72 cards in the set, in the normal set. Buizel, Spinarak. Way we have a Shining Corvusquire. Nice, let's go. Oh, I kind of ruined that. And the Dreadnought at the back. But hey, we got another Shining card. That's that's sick. The, the black and silver, that's, oh, that's pretty. That's really pretty. And that is number 102 out of 122. And of course, we'll go ahead and sleeve this one. And chuck it into a top loader. And so we near the end of the video with this Shining Corvus Squire Shining Fates pack. Let's hope we go out with a bang and get something absolutely amazing from this. One can only hope. If I can fucking open it. There we go. So. Alright. Haven't gotten any like V, V Max cards from this set yet, I don't think. Or from this video at least, but uh, you know, for the final pack, we might get lucky. It's four to the front. Let's do this. Oh, there's a little, little marking on the right there. I mean, on the left. So <clears throat> let's hope it's not something insanely good. We have a fighting energy. We've got a Luxio. A float till. I don't actually think we have him yet. No, we do. No, never mind. We have a Dartrix, Eevee swimming in the water, Gossiflor, Choodle, a Morpeko, Cacnea, Reverse Bosses Orders, and a Holo Decidueye. That's, you know, it's not a terrible way to go out. Would have loved a, a V Max or something, but hey, can't complain. That's still pretty cool. And Decidueye is probably one of my favorite starters from the Sun and Moon series, so I'm not going to complain. Right, so today we managed to pull three pretty good cards. Um, I think that's pretty good for, for what, like, seven packs? Three out of seven? Three hits out of seven packs? That's not bad at all. Leave a like if you guys enjoyed the video, and a comment as well. And yeah, thank you guys for watching this one. Uh, hopefully I'll see you in the next video as well. So, yeah. See ya.